Well, Jeep employees are still processing a deadly situation that happened earlier this afternoon. Yeah, according to Toledo Fire and Rescue, a worker at the Jeep assembly complex was crushed to death. Steve Iwanek, he spoke with a worker who says that they were at the plant during this event. A lot of emotions during this, right? Absolutely. Jeff Cayley, shock, sadness, couple of those emotions radiating off this employee that told me that that's what they were feeling after today's events. And they did not want to share their name or face, but they did share with me what they experienced. For, yeah, this to happen just like that, like in seconds, it's, it's unreal. A day that many Jeep employees will remember forever. It's devastating. Like, I'm still in shock about it. I don't, I don't know what to think about it. Toledo Fire confirmed with WTOL 11 that a worker at the Jeep assembly plant died after being crushed early Wednesday afternoon. However, officials have not shared who it was or how it happened. But this employee, a quality inspector, says they heard it happened while others were on break. I know where this happened was where the chassis and the body comes down together where all the parts from all the plants meet together. So this, this gentleman was doing his job on break and he just happened to be apparently in the wrong spot at the wrong time and the conveyor turned on and, you know, I don't know, it was, it was terrible. UAW Local 12, who represents workers at the plant, shared a statement on Facebook saying, quote, the entire Local 12 family extends our deepest sympathy and condolences to the family of our brother lost today while on the job. But today left employees wondering what happened. Nothing like this has happened there. You know, 18 years since 06 has been open, nobody's been killed in there like the, not in the accident on the job. And sending love to the victim's family. My heart breaks for them. I'm praying for them. I can't imagine. You know, I heard his, his wife called up to the plant. He's got a wife and kids. I heard I'm, that's all I really know, and I, I can't imagine. Now, we reached out to Stellantis, who gave us this statement, quote, Stellantis is aware of an incident involving one of our employees at the Toledo Assembly Complex. The Toledo Fire Department has been called for assistance. As this incident is currently under investigation, we cannot provide any further details at this time. Now, local elected officials also provided our team statements that you can find on our website right now. We did speak with OSHA representatives who confirmed they're starting an investigation into this, and they tell us it could take upwards of six months before results are shared. Reporting in studio, Steve Iwanek, WT. Oh, well, 11.